Hello everyone and welcome to the next episode of my Ark Survival Evolved Scorched Earth playthrough. I hope you're all having a great day and today we're going to set out and we're going to trap a wyvern so we can get some milk so when we hatch our baby wyvern we've got something to feed it. As you see in the last episode I got myself a dragon egg or wyvern egg eventually uh, after quite a few mishaps but we got there in the end and then yeah we've got ourselves a, a lightning egg, lightning wyvern egg. So to grow it up I need some milk and I have a cunning plan on what I need to do. To get myself some milk I'm going to trap a dragon, a wyvern, sorry I keep calling it a dragon. But I'm going to start this one very early in the morning, half past three, oh so early. Uh, just so we get maximum daylight for when we get there. Just made a, I've made a few changes to my base. You see I've extended this out, put some stairs in to make use of the roof. And I made myself a little flyer hanger. Now the the wyvern won't fit in here, I'm sure. I hope it doesn't, because then my trap's not going to work, as you'll see in a minute. The margin are going to be quite quite happy in here. So without further ado, where am I going? That way. Without further ado, I'm going to crack on, get over to my trap, and lure some wyverns in. I shall see when I get over there. Alright, here we are. So this scrappy looking piece of architecture is my idea for a wyvern trap. Quite simple really. Lure it in there. Make sure it's right behind me. Fly through. Argentavis, as you see, can clear it. And I'm hoping that the wyvern gets stuck. Obviously it's only the females that give out the milk, so if we catch a male I'm sorry buddy, but you're not going to be any use to me. So here we have one. We now need to make sure this is right behind me. Is this going to work? No, because he's flown right around it. Bugger. <laughs> okay. Let's try for pass number two. I think I was flying too slowly then. And he's ignoring me. I do not want this loose. You can see they've got really poor turning circles. Come here. Wow. Well, that's off just killing everything else. Let's go find ourselves another one. Just a bit of a female as well. So, there you go. First lesson fly fast. Hopefully, Queen didn't kill them all in her last uh, effort to get the egg. One after me, yep. Okay. Ah. Fingers and thumbs. Getting all these keys. Lightning ribbon. Now I am going to have to be so careful of that breath when it. If I do catch it in my little trap. Suddenly my trap is feeling a bit small. Come on. What are those? Do you know what? Last episode they were chasing me all over the place. Oi, none nuts. Come here. Has that killed it? Yeah, well, right. Now come after me. Come on. Why are they just not egging onto me? Come on. Come 
Where's it gone? Okay, let's go find another one. So, the theory sound. It's just the uh, putting into practice, which is being a bit. Well, that nice little group of them here. What do you call a group of. Wyverns? Oh, here we go. Come on, one of you's going to go in there. Hey, no, nope, wrong button. Hopefully, I can get one in there. Got one. <laughs> I'm not going to get away from this lot. I don't think it quite went in. That's made the that entrance a bit wider. The wyverns do fly slightly higher than this, so building on the ridge like this is a good idea. If you come up and over, the wyvern will then go straight into the trap and immediately go straight down again. And then you should have, like that, lovely. A wyvern in the trap. And make sure you find yourself a this defensible position where you can avoid their breath. Because uh, yeah, it's got range in it, obviously. I've got it in there. Now I've got to try and trank it. Without it breaking loose. Or killing me. Or another wyvern coming up from me and killing me. <coughs> Which is very likely. Stand right next to Queenie so I just jump on her. So if I can knock this thing out, make well, it's been of a permanent trap, then I should have a milk farm. Oh, nice. And it's a bloody male. Do you know what? Queenie can kill this. Well, I know the trap works, so let's go get a female. I don't know what level this one is. Got to check. Right, quick, Queenie. Nice. I decided to make myself a better looking trap. Just did it for aesthetic reasons. But the other thing is, this particular trap I've built just using vanilla assets. Uh, as you know from watching my videos, I use S+. Plus. The last trap was built using S+, plus. this trap is not. Um, I felt it was give a bigger entrance and it's got more chance of actually catching the wyvern and stop it from twisting out and flying out of the top. The only thing you've got to be careful of is, is getting the door shut. Uh, that stops you from getting out of the back. There you go, lovely. One lightning dragon. Caught in there. Uh, I'm right in the way of its fire. I think I should just hide over here and pop off a few shots at it. Nope. Right. Should be able to close that door if I'm really quick. And hopefully I don't get zapped. Leg it back. Just felt this was an all round, slightly better trap to use. You see the ceiling on the top, so you can't get out that way, you can't get out through the door. You can't get out through the other um, through the other pillars either, through the normal dinosaur gates. And there we go, one tranked lightning ribbon. Um, hopefully it's a female, I'm pretty sure it was. 
Yep, lovely. Five milk. Sweet. That's good. So that's how you can get one of the milk um, fairly easily. Finding trap it and get into a trap. One thing I did find though is if you went far enough away, because my last one, it did despawn out of the trap. So if you either build this closer to your base, so it doesn't despawn, um, or just get another one and bring it straight back in there. Either way, it's an easy way of getting um, getting wyvern milk. And yeah, my little baby's going to need it when it grows up. Well, I think I'm going to wrap this video up here. I've done what I set out to do, which is get myself some trap of wyvern and get some milk. Hope you all enjoyed it and find it useful. If you did, give me a like, give me a subscribe. I look forward to seeing you in my next, uh, next episode. So look after yourselves, take care, I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.